There we go. What's up, everybody? Hi, Iso. I think I'm somewhere in Act 9. Yeah. So, maybe we can finish Act 9, start Act 10. Yeah. I'm, I'm doing, I'm tired, not gonna lie, but... <laughs> Power World is fun. It's fun. You easily lose track of time. Yeah. It's it's fun. It's fun. All right, so we've got these um the shit is a desert. Let's go finish this one up. We But yeah, I think I have everything set up right now so that, I mean, I can't, I'm not going to be able to play it tonight. I can tell you that for sure. Jesus. Um, mostly because I'm starting to fall behind on some other things that I need to be making. So, yeah. So, I'm going to have to pass some playing it tonight. But I think I've got everything set up where I won't have to be in there. Come inside and have a nice cup of tea. Alrighty then. Games can be hard with schedules. Not so much things like this, but um, content. That's the current thing. Um, oh yeah, it does kind of look sus. And band. Yeah. I figure out where I'm supposed to go to clear the sandstorm in the desert. I know there was a storm in here, but apparently there's one that I need to clear. <laughs> I love it. All right, all right, all right. 
right, so from from my little things that I have posted on my YouTube channel after stream things, this is something that's void. Or abyssal. I don't remember. Void or abyssal. I think it's abyssal actually. I don't know. But we murdered them. Yeah, I mean, that would avoid me too, honestly. Honestly, from all the fucking crap that I get into, I'm just like, oh, this looks like fun. Let's go do this. I mean, it's good to have hobbies. But then sometimes the hobbies get out of, out of control. The foul stuff. Of course. It's okay, I don't need it anyway. Like right now. So. <sighs> this is what, this is what I'm thinking, right? So we've got this game that's going on right now. Um, once I finish the main part, I might do this like once in a while on stream after that. Um, but we're going to be switching this over to Baldur's Gate 3. What the shit? It's just Kitty. It's just Kitty messaging me. Anyway. It's kind of a sad sex toy if you ask me, but okay. Anyway. Um. Oh. Not the sandstorm. I mean, technically, anything is a sex toy if you try hard enough. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> right? Yeah, yeah. Hey man, there's there's people out there. Anyway, but yeah, we're gonna be going from this to Baldur's Gate three. Because this year is the year that I want to get through some of that backlog of games. And that's also why we're doing the Witcher series playthrough. I mean, we did the Witcher one last year, started up the second one this year. I think I'm probably going to have to play that part again. Oh god, with that fight was fuck nut. Anyway. Why is my hint so itchy right now? Anyway. But yeah, so that's 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 where I'm sitting at right now. Um and then after 
I have no idea how long it takes to get through Baldur's Gate. I'm not going to start over again. I have not made it that far into the game, so... Yeah, um, I'm thinking from what, with, with the Witcher one, um, I'm going to have to go back to a previous save and invest in distance, um, daggers, throwing daggers, actually, to be precise, because apparently that's the way you're supposed to approach that fight. I'm glad I'm not the only one, though, that has complaints about that fight. There was a lot of threads that I had come across online, and people were just like, what the shit? So... There we go. It's that button. Like I'm 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 already I kind of know what I need to do. It's just I need to go back, get access to a, a dagger or whatever the hell it is. Take that with me into that fight. Let's see how it goes. My ear itches so bad right now. Oh yes, I um spent time organizing. Oh yeah, no, we're not doing that. Oh god. Hmm. Yeah, we're about to get rid of some stuff. Why? Why do I keep pushing buttons? I mean, you're supposed to push buttons, yeah, but... These are all... All these things. Um... Shit. We're gonna take this one off. Put that there. No. Yeah, and that's what a lot of people also suggested, but I think it's a me problem when I'm I'm getting buttons mixed up. I mean I'll I'll just fucking straight up admit to that. this. So yeah. Um, it's also a timing thing. But anyhow. We'll get through it. We'll get through it. Yep. 
And I'm just hoping that I will be in a better mood tomorrow. But as of right now, I need to finish up Dragonfall meta. That thing is sitting there done for all practical purposes. I need to just fucking publish it. Slap, well, finish slapping in some pictures and then publish it. <laughs> um. Oh, God. Scum muzzle the slithering? Yeah, she's good at making that phone vibrate at times. Especially when you're sleeping. And she goes like on a message for you, like 12 messages. Thanks, Iso. But anyway, so. Yeah. Venom Ripper the Harrying. Oh, over the weekend we finished our Arma 3 campaign. Um, so I don't remember the name of the map, but that one is done. Um I think we're going to be going back to Altus just for like a, a nice re rebreather, refresher after that. You know, good old Altus, which is like the OG map, I think, or something like that. That's what I associate. And since we have enough people who join, we were thinking of splitting it into two groups so that we can just faster. Oh, don't tell me that. Oh god. All right. Something's got fire over there. Um, I 
I still have not heard back from Amos. But they haven't said no. I'm so hopeful. Okay. Um, let's see here. What other projects am I working on? There's a lot. Vic has fixed the lathe. So that means that I can go back to making wands. Which makes me happy. Unfortunately, we still have to straighten up that room. But we'll get there. We'll get there. That's the Forbidden Vault. So what the fuck is this one called? Yeah, um, that's because the uh, potentiometer, like, the way that you do it is that you, you put the thing on, right? There's a video I posted of how it goes. Um, so it spins, and you've got, go on the back, you have to flip it up or down, I don't remember, I think it's up or down, and that depends which direction it's turning. So it's either doing this, or it's doing this. And we need it to do this. So whichever way that is, I don't remember. Um, and then you, you, you turn the motor on and then you turn up the speed. And what was happening was that when you turned the motor on, it was already starting up the speed. And we were like, so no, he had to fix that. Works now. So... <laughs> Yeah, let me go back to doing those. And we bought the we bought two rods for it. Um because what I was going to do was I was gonna make them two parters so that you can pick the it's called a handle and a blade. Which is basically this. This is the handle. And then this is the blade. And that's like the terminology that I guess a lot of people in the community of this has come up with and so what I wanted to do was that basically it's two parts so you can pick this part and then you can pick this part and then we can put them together also we can make them a little bit longer because yeah the lathe is a small lathe <laughs> so hold on hey Vic Message. Hold on. She good? Ah, oh, she's good. Um, one of the ladies that we go and we sell with on Sundays, she was getting her gallbladder removed. And we were, we were concerned. She had that happen this morning at like 8 a.m. Yeah. This guy looks sketch. This guy looks like he's ready for a fight. Alright. 
Oh, now you tell me. Oh. oh okay. Oh, this thing. I don't know what this is. So we're just going to... We're just going to leave and be like, yep, that's good for you. <laughs> but yeah, we wanted to send... We sent a message to her son to see if everything went well. Everything went well. Everything is good. Oh. Oh. Oh, this thing likes me. Oh, no, no, she doesn't. She went somewhere else. Where'd you go? Me. She's oh. okay. She's in observation until tomorrow. Recover. That's good. All right. Oh. All right, little scorpion. Oh, wow. Everybody's sinking. Oh, that's cool. So they're in Okay, it's like quicksand. The swallowing sands. Oh, this looks sketchy as shit. Okay. Ooh. 
This is what Queen of the Sands fight. Big ol' Scorpion. Oh. Turn her into a scorpion. I didn't even notice that there was a person attached to the tail. What? Um, she will be sent out tomorrow. They're just keeping her overnight for observation. I'm starting to think that a gallbladder surgery removal is a lot more popular than I was originally led to believe. I hope so too. Because I'm finding more and more people who have to have it removed. I am so goddamn lost. No, oh, yeah, she's sweet. She's very sweet. Kind of quiet, but. The Screaming Eagle. Okay. No. Nah. No, nah, she's just in general a pretty quiet lady. Not much of a conversationalist. Like, I mean, even with the other ones, she doesn't really talk much. Out of the three people who show up, it's Lily's. She's the one that just yaps. And there's Helena, which is the one who had the surgery done. And then there's Lulis, which just... Oh, fucking the time. Oh, five hours. Helen. <laughs> Helen. Yeah, is it Helena? Not Helena. 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 It doesn't have an H. Helena. Hey. Okay. And then there's Ofe. I like her. Even if it had an H, it will be Ellen. <laughs> but yeah. 
or very sassy. Oh my god. He keeps messaging. All right, so we did that. All right, so we have the Rogue Harbor and the recurring <coughs> Eh, let's go to the foothills. Let's go find this place. Oh, 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 God. Oh, that's a red one. Oh, what is that? It says new. Oh, she, of course it's with this, oh my God, of course it's this guy. Let's go capture this. Oh. Jesus. Spawning right on into a ginormous fight. Hello, little beast. Yeah. Holy shit. This, this guy that travels and does little beast capture, he needs a new hobby. Like, Jesus Christ. Yeah, we are friends now. <laughs> Says you. Oh, here's another one. fire oh oh okay that's cool maybe that's not cool that guy can get oh he is sneaking behind the lines oh my god this guy's unhinged this guy's unhinged hands down he's unhinged
I'm being attacked by multiple sides here. Right? Something down there that we need to get to. How do we get down there again? Oh yeah, this way. Arctic wolf, but this looks like we're in the desert? Just go with it. We're just fuck. Ah. Oh. Older back. Didn't we destroy that one already? Oh, I barely did damage to this thing already. Okay. Oh. Oh, uh-uh, he's pulling up a whole bunch more of his minions, oh my god. Oh, this one's hard. What's this crazy asshole doing? He's just going along for the ride, huh? Oh, that thing is following me though, the boulder, flying boulder. That was a hard one. That one actually killed me a couple times. Oh. Bile Chewer the Executioner. Ugh. Hmm. 
It was more. Oh my god, this is a big map. Okay. Maybe not. Jesus Christ, Kitty, it's about time. Wait, the Whirling Lake? Hey, me too. Nice. It does. It really does. Pretty much, yeah. Oh, we have a couple of them that are like, oh man, we can snooze like every 15 minutes. After playing the game for so some time, I can definitely see where they probably did a lot of like inspiration and research for in other games. I mean, that sounds like the USA economy ISO. Jesus Christ. Oh, am I dead there? I'll go get some coffee.
We're still doing beast hunts on this. We're in Act Nine. What the fuck? You never give up your day job, here, buddy. I haven't made much changes to the core server. Um stats or whatever the stats um default settings there we go um all i have done was reduce the rates of how fast you get you the player get hungry by half um Changed the egg incubation. Um, we went from 72 down to 10. As in what that entails, I don't know. But doing some research, a lot of people recommended it's a nice... It's a nice setting. And I will agree. That way you still have to wait. You can't just pop those eggs out, you know, just like that. And then Ooh. increase the amount of pals that you can have at a base, but I don't think that is actually changing anything, so. Um, because you could actually add an additional five. Which I think the it's 15 and then the maximum that you can go is 20. So we put it up to 20. I haven't seen much of a difference. So I'm not quite sure how that works. But <laughs> Yeah. But it was worth it. Um, I had come across a fight between two mammal rests, mammoth rests. The big old mammoths that look like green grass earth thing came across two of them that were fighting not not you know that kind of thing no they're, they're actually like button heads and you know attacking each other and killing each other and i was like holy crap so i stayed around and i captured the winner of that and then today Today I got one that was, um, I went into a dungeon that's over by the beach near the, the default starting zone that everybody picks. You did? Yeah. It's, it's hilarious. But anyway, I mean, it's an easy capture, but, um, today when I 
was going down towards the dungeon. I did a dungeon, and um, on the way back, there was one that was on the stairs on the way up. Now, if you're familiar with the, where you start, right? Core starts. Do a 180. Go behind. Go down the ruins, right? Just keep going all the way down to the beach. There's a dungeon there. So there is a part where you have to crawl up the wall to get back up, you know, to go up. Well, the mammoth thing was down below to a point where he couldn't crawl up after you. I must have dumped at least 120 arrows into that thing, but I got it. Ugh. So I now have two level 35 mammoth things. <laughs> that was a lot of arrows. Um, then I actually got five, what was it called? A chalet, the chili ferret thing. I got five of them. One of them had really good stats and the other ones were eh. So I actually did that pal condenser thing. I'm not quite sure how that's supposed to work because I didn't really see any like improvement on stats. So yeah. Yeah, the pal condenser. Like, you're supposed to see, like, a significant increase in stats or something like that. And I'm like, no. I haven't, but okay. Uh-oh. Is that the main base? Because I can tell you one thing right now, Kitty, those elephants are going to screw that thing up along with those deer. Harry Chewer. I will admit, though, that we had a, um, we had a, we had those, those mammoth things just wander into the, into the zone, and, um, I was like, oh, we could totally try to take this out. You know, there's enough, you know, things here. Oh, those are fun. Yeah. The flamethrower ones. That mammoth thing murdered everybody. Almost everybody. Killed my ass like three times. I'm just like, okay. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. That was a basilisk. I kept seeing like all these little statues. It's, oh, that was nice. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. We're going to clip that one. It did. At first I thought they were just like some weird ass mummies or something. And then, and then I saw the name Basilisk. And then at some point in time I stopped moving. I'm like, oh. Oh, shit. Oh, did you murder them all? <laughs> nice. Huh. <sighs> Uh oh, that one that one got forgotten. 
couple of the other ones too. The shit is attacking. I have no idea what that was that I was fighting, but you know what? What the shit? A second. Ah. Oh, okay. Oh. All right. Crafting recipe. And just like that, poof. Okay. So this one is done. You're gonna, you're gonna craft, but you're gonna craft. to go back here. Um, let's just use a portal. Let's see. Let's see. You might be able to. Who knows? Damn. Gonna see what goes in there and what doesn't. Okay. I really need to get rid of some of this. Oh man. Oh, this weird place. Okay, that's the tunnel. I don't need to go into the tunnel. I need to go. Um, okay, so it's been like a couple of weeks since I've been here. 
Like there's an opening on this side. That's a little shit. Okay. I see the entrance over there. Refinery. Let's make sure it's not one that I have. Nope, just a tunnel. Okay. Pile driver. Jesus. There's some like whirling mechanical sounds. Dead end. <gasps> Explosives. Uh, 
are we going to set up? Ugh, monsters are immune to physical damage. Jesus. Ew, some of these are not good. All right. I didn't see the chance. Oh. That's unfortunate. Boy. Rot jaws. Yeah. That was a bit rough, but we did it. Is that like a coinage? You're fixing stuff? What are you fixing? Oh, wait, which base? The main one? But she's the main one.
Is it the main one? He's got a funny story about that one. Ooh. Now the stuff, there might be damaged goods or damaged, damaged things in the main base because I tried to take on a level 34 mammoth and everybody joined. I mean, that's what I usually do if they get stuck, just pop them back in, pop them back out. Oh man. That was rough. That was fun, though. This is a dead end. I also usually do that trick with the putting them in the box, taking them back out when they, um, when they fall down somewhere, instead of going down, finding them, pick, picking them up and tossing them so much easier. Yeah. All right, all right. Oh, 
Oh shit, I'm lost. How do we get through this? Oh, there it is. Oh! General Adis or Adis. Oh, fuck that. Oh, fuck. Don't you fucking need more man of me? No! Fuck! I get so close to killing them, but then they always finish me off first. Ah! Oh, it did a thing. But we're going to go back and find where the other one goes. The other door. As I just run right through all that. That's okay. You can get out of here, that's for sure. And there's another one that's in this area. Uh, at least you have the materials already there, kitty. That sucks. Sticky critters. These things with the the lights or whatever is ridiculous. Get her the good stuff. Okay. Also, oh, thanks for that hill.
She's actually going to get one of each. Because, yes. She gets the good one and then the basic one. Gita! Yep, that's hot. Gita! Vinica! Hi! You want some treats? Come on. Oh! I have to get her back after this. Hold on. Yum, 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 yum. Pretty much, yeah. Honestly, yeah. Uh... Come here. Come here. Yeah. Oh, come here. Oh, come here. Yeah. Don't, not coffee. You, you're too young for coffee. Yeah. So we're going to get a bath this week. She's like, no. No, she needs a bath. <laughs> now she's just going to lick up the crumbs. Oh, come on, Kita. I know it's good, but come on. Let's be real. Come here. What, you want one more? You want one more? For this one, you have to stay up here for a little bit, though, okay? Yeah. No, you gotta stay here. Yeah. Yum, 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 yum. There's no more. There's no more. <laughs> oh. yeah, she's a good girl. I am fucking lost. Okay, let's go this way. What's up, Stitch? Oh my god, they're coming out of the woodwork. Oh, now they brought the fire. Okay. Oh, Jesus. You know, I heard of, of people wanting to be punished, but I think that's a whole new level, Isa. I'm just saying. <laughs> Oh, 
of these green things. You guys have to see this one. I haven't even done anything yet. Ah, oh, she knew. You guys are strange. You guys are so goddamn strange. But not this one. This one. The internal timer set? Okay. What did you do to her? I don't know. Why? She's, what happened? She's scared. I don't know. So, so Hellraiser got the good treats, right? Uh -huh. So we gave, we had the treat moments. Yeah. And then she goes and she lays down at the door. And I was going to do the droid cam because all you see was one pata and part of a tail. Uh -huh. As I'm doing that, nothing. And all of a sudden she just gets spooked by something. I don't know, is she bothering you now? <laughs> this dog is weird. Everybody's fucking weird. I'll give you one photo. From the others. Oh my gosh, she's getting the treats galore today. She got spurred. Um, I still wanted punished for some weird reason. He says it's for memes and asked to be timed out, so it's a thing. It's a thing. Just it's it's a thing. I mean, at that point, you just kind of nod your head and go, huh? I don't get it either. It's not the first time they've done it either. Yeah. Yep. I have learned, especially when it comes to something like that, just don't. I don't know, man.
Yeah. That's a that's, that's a weird request. I'm not gonna lie. That's that's a whole new level of notice me senpai kind of thing. But I've come to accept the weirdness. You also press zero too much. <laughs> oh man. All right, let's get to somewhere else so that I can show you what I see. Well, kind of. That's what I see. <laughs> Just the one foot and the tip of the tail. Okay, that's also weird. Mmm, this person's doing something sketch. Oh shit, not one of these again. No, 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 no. I. Oh! Mm, this one's starting to hurt. Might have to. I'm gonna have to check something. Oh, don't you need more mana? Died a lot there. No game sound? Uh oh, hold on. There should be game sound.
That's unfortunate. Huh. I thought Vexile does not have a configuration for this. Okay. Okay, there we go. Oh, that's weird. I mean, there's just people out there that just, yeah. Jesus Christ. I mean, we had that one that gave me a follow and oh, what was that message that he said? That I, I just right out banned him. Hold on. Oh, it's, it's not there anymore. Yeah, no, we had somebody who dropped a follow at the very beginning of the stream. It sounded, it read like a bot. It read like a bot so much. Some said to go through the chat logs on that one, I guess. Wait, did we get? No, we still haven't. What the shit? Okay, so it's not that way. Are we sure it's not this way? Yeah, no, there's nothing in here. How come? No, the person that dropped a follow earlier tonight um, basically was just like, it read like one of those that's trying to get the um, commissions for artwork. It read like that at first and then it said, like, drop me a Discord invite so that I'm in your streams. Or something like that? That one was weird. That one was a weird one. Timeouts for points. That honestly also sounds weird. Oh, 
A ban roulette? You want a ban roulette? What the fuck is a ban roulette? I have this somewhere, don't I? I do not. Huh. running out of space and I don't know what to do. I guess we're gonna have to start going through these and being like, mm, yeah, get rid of this. Probably good. Stream Elements is pretty, pretty easy to do a lot of stuff with, which is nice. Actually, we have a guild stash. We Just put these in here for now. Oh, one of those. Oh, what was it? It was sometime last year, I think. Now, I'm going to be honest. I don't have, like, an amazing, you know, panel set down there. But, I mean, I really don't see that as, like, oh, I need to have this in order to, you know, like, advertise and everything else. Like, it's just, it's more like, ugh, it's an afterthought. That's on me. I know. But um, somebody had come into the stream and was advertising for their designs. And I remember that we just kind of ate them alive. No regrets on any of that, though. Like... I'm gonna be honest, if you have if you have the balls slash audacity slash the ego to go into a streamer's channel and advertise your things what the fuck? I'm gonna be honest as as a streamer, as somebody who does content, because I'm not only doing streams, I'm also doing YouTube videos and guides and other stuff. When I want something I will look for it. I will come to you. Don't fucking come to me. I will come to you. I think that's true with anything. Or that too. I mean, like seriously, how does one how does one find them if not advertising though? Yeah, right. Like, I like to learn. I like to learn. I like to do a lot of things myself because I'm one of these people that I like. I'm one of these people. Yeah, I'm starting to repeat myself. I'm one of these people that likes to continue continuous education in so many different fields and I know that when you know if you compare my streams and my setup to what I had years ago when I started to what I have now 
I think I've come a long way and all of that's been mostly self-taught. Um, a couple of other things too, but I mean, I don't mind asking for, you know, someone to do a design for me, but at the same time, I want to challenge myself. I want to teach myself how to do that because I think it is a fun activity. <clears throat> Kitty has actually made some of my emotes. She's my sister, and she's also, like, right now, not so much because she's preparing to do a whole, a, a huge move, probably out of state. But, like, I use her because, you know, blood relatives, you know, that, and I want to support her because she's my sister, and advertise her things so that, you know, people know. But, yeah. Yeah, no, I remember, and then that guy, like, started to, like, try to argue his stance of why he found it, like, no, oh, that's perfectly fine, like, the people come in, and then that, you're supposed to, like, advertise, I think I actually have that on my page now, like, who does all of those things, because they, they were like, well, you don't even have, like, the person listed that does your graphics and stuff, and it's like... Just because they don't have it fucking listed doesn't mean that they're looking. Like, what the shit? Oh my god. Anyway. We're going to path a building. I got three points to allocate before I do this. <laughs> I think I actually have that listed when you first joined. I know there's be excellent to each other and then there's something else. I don't remember what. I finish this one up. Boop. 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 Ew, why is this one with a shield? Yeah, no, we're not gonna do that. I'm not using a shield with this. Like it doesn't like the weapon configuration doesn't even have a shield with this. So why am I allocating that into a shield? Sorry, I have some questions right now. Okay. But anyway. Also, going back to that, I'm also one of these people that I'm I'm going to be constantly doing, trying to do better with my streams. A lot of people seem to just find that one thing and then they don't change. And I mean, I can't hate on them for that. Ow. But at the same time, I mean, you get kind of stagnant after a while. You just gotta, like, change it up, like, once a year or once every other year or something. Just make a little, you know, a small little change. I mean, this year I'm going to be redoing my Twitch bot. Amongst other things, obviously, but...
Overlays, I do want to change those a little bit. But yeah, just try to, try to learn something new or something, like fuck. It's gonna take some time still. about these things. Oh, should I open something? There's an orb of regret. No regrets. Sure, the rotting core. Like, I'm not even gonna go back and discover all of that shit. <sighs> Ooh. Dude, this has got to smell god awful. Ugh. This looks sus. Ugh. Something doesn't seem right. No shit, really? Yes. It would appear our old friend Malachi has one final trick to play. A thaumaturgical wound to the hearts of my precious beast. This complicates things, but not perhaps so much that there is nothing we can do. Exile, listen to me. I'm about to release the souls of our unholy trinity from their decanter. Oh god, no. Don't do that. Their anger will exude more power than you have experienced ever before. You must defeat them one no. by one. No, don't do it. Remnants into something don't do it. To coax the dark ember from I don't think I am ready for this. Ready yourself. No. <laughs> Let's have it. Oh, shit. Oh, okay. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm like mentally preparing myself to fight in this small little little arena. Oh my god, okay. Oh. Thing, squirrel. But that's two years of fun. Maybe. I don't know. I think we're underwater. I'm not quite sure, but I keep seeing the shimmer. You have to give me a second, squirrel. I am. I am fighting some some nasty shit. What, Pal World? Oh, 
Or The Witcher 2. I'm sorry to say, Squirrel, but I, I played it last night into the wee hours of this morning. That is a game that is definitely something you play in doses. I know. Oh, this thing again. I will admit, though, I do miss the Arcanites that we would have. That definitely hits the spot. About as far as that goes. We got some happy tentacles here. I just keep going. Fuck. Let's try it again. This is a weird map. Shit. These whirlpools are fucking me up. Oh my god. the shit do I go? I don't know. This is like never ending. Oh, 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 I see it, I see it, I see it. Stop touching crap. Stop touching crap. Oh, wait, that's the door.
Right. Oh, we don't do nothing all that. Okay. Oh, Jesus. Fuck. All right, one more to go. The rate that the new people find this channel, I think most most other active followers are like over a year. You're like the the newest permanent, basically. Or maybe not exactly permanent, but you know what I mean. Recurring. I saw you've been here for like, yeah. That sounds like an umber thing. That's what umber did. He yeah, and followed and then followed back. Why? I don't know, but... Jesus. Ah. <laughs> uh, streamer is not following streamer. Oh no. It's been a while.
All right. No. Oh! It's a long ass time, both of you. This is a hard fight. Did that. We did that. That's gonna be a long ass thing <laughs> on YouTube. Oh my god. Holy shit. Only died a few times, but you know what? Hey, it's fine. Oh god. Did. From when I started, Hellraiser is not going to be the oldest account. Bogey, I think, has a couple of months out before that. Vic might have it as well. Now I'm wondering. <gasps> oh my god. No one! Because nobody has found that yet. <laughs> Holy shit, Vic, you have... You got less time than hell. Holy crap. Alright, so it's gonna be a tie between Hellraiser and Bogey, but I really do think Bogey's got him beat by a couple of months. Hold on. Hold on. Let's see if I can summon him. Probably not, but... I, yeah, yeah, follow time, not sub, I know. That's why I'm saying maybe.
You know, that wouldn't surprise me. <laughs> I'm gonna just stop droid cam. Like, from broadcasting. Let's see how Boogie responds. Let's just say that I want to be able to stream if it wasn't for Vic, honestly. You guys wouldn't even know I existed, Jesus. <laughs> yeah, you guys are probably yeah, you guys gonna say you guys are probably luck out on that one and be like, yeah. Probably would have kept your sanity longer. I have started Act 10. Nice. Well, once more, you owe me. Diamond Tide. Welcome. See, they're not even asking for any cookies or anything else. Ooh. Okay. Oh, that's good. <laughs> I don't want to be the reason why people lose their sanity. You're in, you're in the walls, Rochette. Why do I know that one? The dead man walks where the living fear to tread. I swear to God, I've heard that one somewhere. For, oh, okay. It's for fools rush in where angels fear to tread. It's an essay on criticism by Alexander Pope. You see my eyes? You can't have my eyes. These are my eyes. Remember, we do this for freedom. It was good to see that you survived, my friend. He has not seen the message. Let's hear on Discord. No. I see on Discord. Actually here. Saint, Kitty, Orion, Darth, and Hatter. All of you guys are probably playing Pal World. Oh my god. We must discover where Kitara resides. Only then can we issue our final blow. Jesus Christ, you guys. <laughs> oh man. Power world is more than this. Oh. I mean, 
it takes years. It's, it's going to take some time, Stitch. I mean, you still have to, like, meet everybody, get to know all the weirdos that lurk in the shadows. Apparently, Trix is getting her ass kicked in Baldur's Gate. Isa would ban himself day in, day out, probably. I don't fucking know. Oh, a new person. Oh shit, lady, where the fuck have you been for the nine previous acts? VIPs are held by certain specific people. There's only one person that has that. Okay. She's very, very energetic about stuff. Ooh. Oh, this is gonna be great. Okay. Yeah, book is not seeing that message. God damn. I've actually never clicked those until now. <laughs> All right, guild stash. I don't know what I'm doing with these, but I don't want to get rid of them because they're of the they're the pretty dark color and blah blah blah. This one can get rid of them. Put those in there too. I, no, go away, Divinia. Greetings. Oh hell no! What the fuck, I so? Remember, we do this for freedom. So. The only way to get VIP in this channel would be to support me through Patreon or Ko-Fi. Um, that's one of the perks. The reason why is because if it's, it's one of the ways that I feel like I can show my appreciation to the support. If I mean, you're willing to support me through one of those platforms, that's the only reason why that thing exists. And as of right now, there is only one individual that has that. I mean, there's nothing stopping you from doing that, but at the same time, that's that that's a that's a decision you have to make. When it comes to mods, there's Vic. Obviously, I mean, he, he's in the other room. I mean, it's kind of a, a thing. <clears throat> it's not exactly a pay. It's the, You get VIP for being a supporter. It's not exactly... I mean... Yeah. But when you put it that way, that's that doesn't sound right. <laughs> Oh shit. I need more mana. Oh yeah, we're gonna be needing more mana this whole entire fucking run, I think.
Yeah. Yeah, I think Pokey went to bed for the night. <laughs> we'll have to ask him to do that like some other time just to see. I'm legit curious. <laughs> oh, I think did not want to die. <laughs> Get the farming. Jesus Christ. Of course you have an altar out here that you're exploring. Jesus Christ. Oh, speaking of, Kitty, um, I actually captured a merchant. That one actually happened entirely by accident. Um, as I was exploring, it was actually not that far away from our from our main base, right? Um, I came across a group of raiders or the the assholes, the thugs, or whatever the hell. They were fighting the merchant, and then there was like. These cute little pink fairy things that, I'm using the word cute loosely here, that were also involved with the fight, and then something that was blue. And those things were low on health, and I was like, I'm just going to take this opportunity and start chucking the things in there, and somehow I caught the guy. <laughs> so yeah. I'm not quite sure. I I got one of those fairy things too, but yeah, no. It was. Yeah. I didn't find that out until I got back into the base and I accessed the PAL thing, and I was like, wait. Where the fuck did this guy come from? Oh, shit. I know, right? It's a little fucked up.
you're not technically wrong, squirrel. Oh, that actually makes me feel pretty good, uh, Stitch. <clears throat> Determine hot scenes in movies. Not determine. Uh, not determine. Describe. Because I don't think you know exactly the kind of interesting things that I find attractive. Okay, we'll do, Kitty. Yeah, we'll go with that. We'll go with that one, I saw. I finally got a torture cage room open. I'm not entirely sure you put me through. Yeah, it's a lot of warfare grinding. Find me again, and we'll continue our Cute clown trying to pump some bullets. Yep. I do remember that one. Alright, we got another one opened. Woo! I'm finally getting these stones to like drop so I can open up the rooms. Yeah, let's go get more coffee. I think we're actually out of coffee. I'm actually not a fan of the Acolyte hunts. I don't know why. I think that's the only thing that I'm not really like, oh my god, when it comes to Warframe. That's why I don't do them. Like... I don't know. There's just something that I'm just like... Eh. 
That's why instead of doing that for the Archon Shards, I go do the Calls Garrison thing. I don't know what it is. It's... I don't know if it's like a... You put in a lot of time and effort to do those missions and then the reward is just... Uh. Oh, yeah. Yeah, no, it's just... I feel like those Acolyte Hunts are lacking in something. I think it's the rewards. Or the amount of RNG, especially in that game and me, just... I don't get the satisfaction from doing those and getting the rewards. I'll go with that. Dude, the Enidim is really, really good. In fact, when the Duveri Paradox first dropped, I think that was actually one of the earliest ones that I got. And then after formatting it a couple of times, maxing it out all the way, I found out that in Sealed Path, doing um, the, the story, where you go and you have to kill the Oral Worm at the end, Enidim just melts through those rings. Hands down. At that point in time, I was just like, yep. This is something to definitely invest in. Fighting a good build, dumping a bunch of fucking formas on it. No, seriously, it's... For those of you who might be watching and are wondering about like that, like obviously this is a Warframe topic, but... Seriously, go get yourself the Enodim. Format it a few times, max that sucker out. You won't be disappointed. That thing hits hard. Oh, I didn't start the bot kitty. I'm sorry. I think that also the reason why I like the end of them a lot in that whole entire set of weapons is, um... It feels a lot like the Lex, the Lex Prime, actually. Um, if you're new-ish to the game and you're looking for a secondary, you know, you have it unlocked. Um, Fortuna's weapons with Zood. Um, if you haven't gotten your kit guns from Dad over in Deimos. Etc. 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 If you're looking for a starter, good, solid 
secondary that can get you through some stuff. The Lex Prime, I think, is like what a requirement mastery rank of like two, which you can get real quick in that game. That thing, if you do it right, will take you through pretty much damn near the entire system. I actually really like that one. That one took me through, actually, I think the entire system. It's a really low entry mastery rank weapon that you can easily get the parts for. Also, if you keep it, you can actually put an Incarnon evolution on it, which sucks. It's also awesome. So about Prime, yeah. I was really hoping that the Incarnon actually worked on the on the dual Lex. It doesn't. On the Aclex thing. I was just like, son of a bitch. So I had to go and get myself another Lex Prime, which I think I actually have all the parts for now. I just have to build it again, but it sucks that it doesn't work for the duels. Latem is well, that's pretty good too. Honestly, most of the Carnons I have come across, well, the the original ones, the ones that dropped with the Zeramin. Um Oh wow, I misspoke actually. Those came with the Zeramin, not the Angels of the Zeramin, not the Daviri. But yeah, when I took the thing into the Daviri thing, that's when I found out that holy shit. But anyway. Um no, Angels of the Zeramin. Those weapons, that entire weapon set, really fucking good. Kind of a pain to evolve some of them if you have a mouse button issue like mine. Alright, kitty. <clears throat> but, other than that, they slap and they slap hard. On the rooftop, okay. It does, but those are for my melee. It's okay, I changed it so that... So for my Warframe lo uh, loadout, a lot of games I play, my interact is F, which is uh, usually not the same that you get with a lot of games. Usually it's E for interaction. But my interaction button's always F. So I actually changed it this past week on stream to not the middle mouse button since it just did not work. I changed it to E and now it's just like boom, 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 easy peasy, lemon squeezy. But yeah, mouse button four and five, uh, melee. I was not watching. I actually have a pretty good one, but thank you anyway. 
I just prefer the... the other weapons I've been doing lately. <laughs> Especially the dual toxicis. Holy shit, that thing. Audio issue. Wow! Oh fuck! Ah! Ha! Ah, ah. Ha! Ow! 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 The pain! Ow! Woo! Act ten kicked the difficulty up. Holy sh! Isn't it? So we'll see you around. Oh wow, it actually is that time. Well not not time for logging off at Bryce, oh yeah. Mmm. The recoil does get a bit annoying, not gonna lie. But, if you ever played Apex Legends, or Arma 3, you just kind of learn to, to accept recoil like, like a bitch on those things, like holy crap. Especially Apex Legends, holy shit, those things. Thanks, Bogey! Holy shit! Okay, I've not been streaming for eight years, but... <laughs> Thanks, Bogey! Oh my god! That's awesome! Alright, I'm going to bed now. <laughs> Holy shit! Yeah! Bogey's got you beat, hell! <laughs> Oh, I think that might have been from something else, though. That may have been, like, when I was going to do streaming, like, so, so long ago, ancient faraway land. <laughs> Holy crap. Well, Bogey is my best friend, so I've known him since 2008, maybe a little bit before that, so eight years ago would have been, what, 2016? Maybe they like squirrels. <laughs> 2016, maybe 2015. Yeah, 2008, man. Yeah, so that means that... Well, okay, so let's see here. I'm trying to remember when we were thinking about... Book and I had so many ideas that we were going to do. We were going to do a podcast. That's why I have the blue snowball microphone. That never happened. I know that I was wanting to do streaming at some point in time. That never happened until obviously I moved here. What else did... Mm. No, that, that would have been before moving to Mexico, hands down. Maybe it really was just that, when I was just like, hey, maybe I should do this. Hmm. I got questions.
Because that would have definitely been in university time, too. Because I didn't graduate university until 2016. Oh, wow, that's a lot of different places to go. Woo, boy. Okay. Okay, so I guess I've been streaming for, well, Hellraiser accounts at five years. So I guess, yeah, maybe. Hmm. Oh yeah, no, I, I arrived here in Mexico in November of 2016. Got married to Vic in 2017, March. Eight years, seven months. Almost nine. That's almost nine years. So yeah, that would have been 2000. That probably would have been 2015, hands down then. So yeah, that was probably, that was probably when I was trying to figure out what the fuck I was going to do with myself. Yeah, yep, yeah, you moved to Tennessee 2018, which would have been, yeah, oh, fuck. Yeah, no, that timeline checks out. Hmm. I gouger. Oh. Ooh. That looks kind of painful. Box pack there, come on. Ah. 
All I got was a portal scroll out of that box? That's a... Wow. No worries, kitty. Bot's still not working. I'm not going to start it. Moss Lord. Oh. Ouch. Okay. I mean, this isn't showing that they got any other connections, so. Finish cleaning it up at least. Oh, there's a thing over here. Restless pauper. Okay, or pauper. Pauper. Touch the box. Get shitty reward. I thought that this was like just a small little thing. No, this is a big fucking place. Okay. What am I supposed to do with these things? Oh. <laughs> Teleportation thing. It's a lot of bones. Oh, I love the decoration over here. Very useful, resourceful. Recycling. True Necromancer's way. A leader cannot simply stride forward to the future and expect his people to be able.
him. Just fucking go for it. Just, just run, man. Just run. Precisely. <laughs> I did the thing. Apparently I've only done these. I'll take it. Oops. I'm gonna go back and get the rest of those, but yeah. I thought that said salad chest at first. Oh man, a salad sounds good. Sounds really weird saying that, but I actually make my own croutons. And this last batch, I mean, they're going stale by now, but this last batch I made was actually from sourdough bread. They're really good. Sourdough bread croutons. I highly recommend you try it sometime. <laughs> oh my god, I can get a skeletal hideout? Oh, this is it. This is gonna be my hideout. Oh, this is perfect. Oh, no, 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 it's going to be this, hands down. Fuck yeah. I have to allocate, like, move people around and stuff, but... Oh my god, I love it. I love it! Oh god. Oh, this is perfect. I wish I could make the house look like this. I don't think Vic would allow that, but... I might have a problem if I start bringing home, you know, like human bones and remains. He's gonna be like, um. But the color scheme, like, oh my god. They must go through a shit ton of candles, though. Oh, it's perfect. It is perfect, perfect, perfect. Also, that tiling. Oof. The chandelier with the human... Oh my god. Yes. Oof. Okay. I approve. 10 out of 10. How the shit do I get out of here?
There's a weird auditory glitch that I'm getting. It's not just something on your guys' end. It's definitely through the game. I'm not quite sure what's causing it. There we go. I can't remember what it was. Ew, oh, those fucking suck. This one's way better than one of them. Okay. I think I have space. Yeah, we can do that. Perfect. Okay, wait a minute. Oh, okay. So I found this one, so that means that there was one that was kind of back a little bit? Oh no, that was the first one I found. Yeah, okay. Oh, whoops. Alright. <laughs> A lot of gems dropping now. The torched quartz. See, this is why you can't. This is why you can't have nice things. Like this thing looks ransacked. That is a body that is going to waste. I can't even minionize them. I mean, come on. That's such a waste. There's another one. Oh, man. Ooh, no one over here with the skeletons. Okay.
So I was pushing that. I guess I was pushing six. I see an arrow over there. Nice little rooms, yeah. Okay. There's enemies in there. See them dancing. There we go. Brutal beatdown. Let's go back this way, grab this area that I missed. You almost got me. Are you going for the retrieval? Okay. Remember the list. Okay. Oh, that reminds me. Okay, so we have a plaza that lives. Yeah, that lives. That, that's nearby. We'll go with that. And it actually got fully built. Um, right before the pandemic hit, like not even a full year, I don't think. So it's, um, three stories. And as the years have progressed, it has been slowly getting more and more businesses to, you know, come in. I mean, they got, they got screwed over by the pandemic, but they're, they're, they're striving now. They're, they're actually getting more and more businesses. And one of the businesses that moved in, it's called Log On. Never heard of them. But they got some really cute things. Um, they have like these little <sighs> it's a it's a kit. That you assemble and it's um, like MDF, like laser cut MDF with some sticker things and little miniatures and you put them together. It's, 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 it's a kit. I don't know how else to put that. Um, I'm actually looking this up. Here we go. This is one of them. And they have these things and they're so freaking cute and everything else. And they're so tiny, but they're so freaking adorable. I've never seen these things before in my life. But, yeah. One of these days. One of these days. Never heard of the company before, but I really like the little uh, laser cut MDF 3D printed little kits. They're super fucking adorable. 
they have some that are for like bookends or ones that you stick in like your bookcase to take up a space where something might be you know missing like a filler they also have like these other little ones that are kind of more like a diorama kind of looking thing One of them is like a, a little book store. One of them is a little coffee shop. It's the amount of detail that goes into them. I'm just like, yeah, I don't want so bad. I don't remember what spawned that conversation, but I mean, these kind of look like, ah, these kind of look like the areas, kind of. You can see them as being like little miniatures, like little miniature Path of Exile. Corpses and all. Which way are we going? I'm going this way. I'm not going this way. Oh, I'm glad I actually could have died. Oh, I didn't miss those. That is a dead end. Let's turn on life flask. We got for this one. Yeah. More dead bodies that I did not make. Desecrated chambers. Yeah. Oh, that's a lot of dead people right there. Didn't we have a fight in here? Ouch. 
Oh, this is, yep, okay. I don't know what the end goal of this whole entire thing is right now, but I'm here just to kill shit. <laughs> The world is on fire. Holy shit. I don't remember seeing that. Okay. And our father, the great Katava, will split asunder the rocks of the earth, pulling himself out of them. In other words, crazy people doing crazy shit, believing crazy shit, uprising. Hey, thanks for the follow. Is a sack of bar? I'm hoping I pronounced that one right. Oh, I'm gonna die. Oh, I'm gonna die. Go, go, skeletons. Oh, shit. Did we just take this guy down? Destiny Leather.
restore a part of my own. Are, is this the cathedral? Are we looking for him on the rooftop? I don't know. No. Oops. Did not mean to do that. <laughs> the mouse went to the monitor. Look at them go. Accuracy, rank two. Level 74, let's go. I guess we go up. Oh! They're reassembled! I can't just plow through that either, okay.
Oh, what was that? It's a bit brutal, I'm not going to lie. Don't get hit by that thing. Or these things. Or that. Or that. He's so close to being dead. He is so close to being dead. That was a bit rough. That could have been a lot better. A lot better. Of course. And they both, yeah. Well then. Too much clatter. Let's go back up. Um. Things I can't sell to you. Okay. Oh, wait. No. Oh, okay. dump all of this in here and come back for it later. Is that it? I guess that was it. Okay. That zone is done. That's not good. <laughs> oh, God. All right. I can foresee having to work on some of this outside of stream.
Oh, don't tell me Vic left his keys. What? Ow, 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 the hair on the hair. No. must be the other route. Oh. No, it isn't. I mean, it is, but it isn't. So we just have to go back to here. Find all of these places. Good choice.
Jesus. All right, I need I need to do something else with this. Holy shit. Oh, let's go back. All right, we're actually going to call it there. I know it's like six minutes early, but I have a delicious bread thing that I want to eat. So, and yeah, we got oh yeah, it's five minutes. So, um, obviously, I'm at a point where I need to do some rethinking of some choices. Build wise, or I don't know what, armor wise maybe, but that's gonna be something that's probably not worth streaming. Honestly, I'm gonna be honest with you on that. So I'll be doing that over the week. All right, let's do the whole entire sign off. All right, boys and girls, and everything that's in between. That is it for me this evening. I will catch you guys tomorrow. We're gonna be doing more of The Witcher 2, unless I'm in a really bad mood and I decide that I don't want to play that game. I don't know. Um. If you are in the Discord community, we got stuff going on. We completed Arma 3's map on this past Saturday. Um, we're going to be going back to Altus, um, just as a refresher and everything else. Um, we've got our test run for Vampire the Masquerade this coming Saturday. So if you have not signed up for that yet, let me know. I mean, I already know, but you need to tell me a name and a password so I can register you through the whole entire setup through the Foundry VTT. Um, if you have not noticed, we actually have a Palworld server that we started up yesterday. If you want to connect to that, you're going to have to ask me and I'll give you the info on that. Um, I think that's honestly all that we have going on right now this week. And as always, announcements, there's people chatting all the time in Discord. Well, kind of. I mean, you get the meme lords and other weird shit that just gets posted. Um, but yeah. So, yeah. I am going to be logging off. We're going to be eating this delicious Danish roll. It's a fig Danish roll. Mm. Um, and I'm going to be working on some guide stuff. I'm not going to be doing Power World tonight because I a, need a break from that one and B, I need, really need to get these guides done um, before the weekend hits. So yeah, there's that. Other than that, you guys have been awesome. I'll see you tomorrow. Till then, take care, stay safe. Bye. That's it, man. Game over, man. It's game over. <laughs>